What's going on guys, Madden 22 is here. I'm so excited to bring you this video. This is gonna be Madden 21, Madden 22 launches later today. And I wanted to let you know that if you want to see what I'm doing in Madden 22, I'm gonna be streaming later tonight and as soon as the game launches. So be sure to subscribe so that way you don't miss any of the uploads. And I'll also be posting on my community tab whenever I go live. Okay guys, so I wanted to bring to you today a concept that you're gonna to wanna to know um, as we prepare for Madden 22. This is a really, really good concept. I tested it out, I watched some film on some of the guys that already have Madden 22. And this is something that you're gonna to wanna to know how to do um, if you're gonna be successful in Madden 22. It's a very easy way to beat Cover 3. Cover 3 is gonna be the meta right off the rip. If you haven't already checked out my defensive guides and stuff like that where we talk about zone, what zones do, my defensive encyclopedia is in the description. It'll break down what every zone in the game does. But what I wanna really focus on here in this video is a really good way that you can attack cover three in this year's game. And really the big thing that I wanna really hit on is route running, the way route running is gonna work at Madden 22 and really what you need to be aware of. It's actually very similar to next gen um, Madden 21 in this. And so I'm on the PlayStation 5 right now and I wanted to bring you this video. This is a cover three beater out of the gun bunch. I'm in the New England Patriots playbook. I think New England is probably at least the top three, if not the number one playbook in Madden 22 for the offensive side of the ball. The player we're gonna be going over is corner strike. And what I wanna show you um, is these is these very, very specific types of, uh, very, very specific types of uh, way that this coverage is going to work. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna grab, let me just make sure, um, we're not gonna grab that. We're gonna go into, um, let's just go into Dime 146 and we're just gonna go over the Cover 3 Sky because um, I just wanna show you the specific route. So what you're gonna see is you wanna run, run with your bunch to the wide side field, but I just want you to watch the circle receiver here. What I'm gonna do is I'm simply gonna motion him to the numbers and snap the ball. And what you're gonna see is he's gonna run this corner route really interesting. You see how he rounds it out to the outside like that? And that's gonna draw a couple of uh, defenders. These corner routes this year, the way they're gonna be ran, at least in my opinion, you're gonna notice that corner routes are gonna be a little bit slower developing. It's why I talked before about the importance of this route right here, the table route to the running back. Against any coverage, you can basically just throw that and you're gonna have success. So what you wanna do, as opposed to a smart or a uh, motion out corner route, is I actually like the smart route and out route motioning and out, because you'll see here he's gonna run it a little bit flatter. He's still gonna get this uh, vertical seam up to Godwin, and you're gonna be able to, to basically use or catch that, especially, um, and this is something that we've been doing in Madden for years, but again, let me show you. You basically have a high-low. And the other thing is these flat routes are really good in Madden 22 because of the locomotion, the way that the routes are going to work. You really want to be capitalizing on these routes. This is definitely a year where you're going to see bunch is going to be very effective because it has the ability to have two flat routes on both sides of the field. And what you're going to see is if they blitz you, you see how I can easily throw that flat route and get about you know seven to eight yards. Now the other thing that I wanted to go over in this video is if you don't motion out the corner route, you will have opportunity to throw it. I just wanna show you kind of how that's gonna look. So what you see here is he cuts to the sideline. That read right there is super, super good in Madden 22. Whether they have zone drops on or not, it's really gonna be a tough route to stop. So I would encourage you that if you have not already tried out this corner route to go ahead and do that, just motion it out to the outside just a little bit, get some space on the outside. And as you see here, even Brady without the gunslinger ability is able to put the ball in a very unique position. Now, the last thing I wanted to go over is the C route. I think the C route is going to be back this year. Um, you see, the one thing I will say about this is that the C route, again, and this is something very true of out routes. Let me put an out route out there, um, smart route and out route. I've talked about this a little bit before. This is a really good route for a solo receiver because you see how he rounds it to the outside like that? See that little qu quick cut? That's a different type of out route than I think we've ever seen in Madden. Um, I haven't seen it in any of the years that I've been playing. And what you're seeing happen is he's basically going to do like a rounded out. And it almost turns into a back shoulder fade. Just hard outside pass lead. Look how quick that quick out works. That's against a purple zone out of the cover three. It's going to be very successful. So I would encourage you to add the smart rounded out route into your playbook. Um, it's a very good read against cover three. Um, it's uh, right there. I threw it a little bit too early, but it's a really good read against cover three. It's a really good read against cover um, four, and it's a really good read against man to man. Let me show it to you one more time. Just rounds to the outside, and again, sometimes that purple will get out there, but he'll never intercept the ball. He'll always just simply swat the ball. And again, if I wait just a little bit longer here, just get it all the way up there. You see, I can maybe potentially put that in. And again, last thing I wanted to hit on real quick is if you don't motion this corner route out again, I just wanna show you what happens. If I don't motion him out like we traditionally would, you see I'm gonna have an easy easy window to hit that, and I could potentially rack that upfield for a touchdown. So this corner, corner strike concept 
is actually, I think, going to be one of the better concepts this year. It wasn't honestly that great in Madden 22 with the way zone drops played. Um, you're going to see here, look at all that curl, curl flat. See how I can rack that flat up for about 15 yards if they don't have a hard flat? And then once you start to force your opponent to have to do stuff like motion or um, they, like where they have to Mabel coverage, that's where this specific route from Spacing Switch, watch this motion out route. You're going to see it's a really quick developing, quick cut outside, just like that speed cut out, going to beat man, going to beat zone this year. That's really important to understand. If the defense goes to man-to-man, -to -man, um, it's going to beat man-to-man, -man, this little quick out route cut to the circle receiver. These out routes are money this year. They're money against man. They're going to be money against zone. I would encourage you to try them out. They're very difficult to intercept. It's going to force your opponent to have to play a lot of cover two. Obviously, we know what happens when that happens. But this corner, this little table route on both sides or, or flat route with a corner and a fade, going to be very difficult to stop in Madden 22. So I wanted to get this out here before, um, before the game officially launches. Um, this seam read is also really good. That was not very good in Madden 21 because of the two-man catch interactions. In Madden 22, this seam route right here to the RB uh, or the R1 is going to be really, really good. Right up the skinny, right there, easy read. And the reason why this could be so good is because it's going to hold their user. So this is where we're going to get into some of this, um, this meta from the bunch that I think you're going to see. And let me just show you one little thing on this PA post route. Let me just show you the circle receiver. Watch his cut to the inside. You see that rounded cut? Now, again, the cover three was able to pick me off. But just that you see the rounded cut. So what you can do off of this, and this is where New England is going to become really good next year, um, you can actually run something like a drag, little uh, little mesh concept over the middle with the two inside guys, have a vertical to pull that seam, um, and then look at that post route just come underneath in that pocket. That's going to be something to walk out, look out for as well in Madden 22. Anyways, last thing I wanted to go over is once you kind of have started to really establish the fact that you can um, you know, really hit them in a, a number of different ways, then you can go to a play like Pat Sale that has this post right here. And what you can do is you can have your vertical, and then you can actually, this, this in route right here, the speed in, these are really good routes this year, um, especially for how the game's going to work, because you're going to see that they these these cuts are so smooth. The route running is probably the best it's ever been. So really take advantage of that with these in routes. These drags are really, really good. And again, I just don't want you to sleep on the fact that the out route could be one of the best routes in Madden 22. Thanks for watching this video. And if you want to come check out the stream tonight, I'm going to be streaming uh, as soon as Madden 22 launches. So be sure to come by there. If you want to get my free offenses and defenses that I'm going to be releasing all throughout the Madden 22 season, time for my text message membership by texting the word Madden to 208-218-6900. That number is going to be in the description. And I'll be sending out free offenses and defenses. There actually will be a free Madden 22 offensive uh, ebook released this week for you guys. So if you haven't signed up for it, text the word Madden to 208-218-6900.